Rose here for another one of our FAQ videos. So what do you want to know? Hello, today we're going to answer our frequently asked question, how to open and close our bucket lids. Many of our customers often call or email us asking how to apply our bucket lids to achieve an airtight seal. They also want to know the proper way to remove the lids without damaging them. Our standard spouted and reusable lids fit our three and a half, five, six, and seven gallon buckets. All lids, except the snap-on reusable lids, have a styrene butadiene rubber gasket to secure liquids in transportation. A rubber mallet is needed to apply all the lids except the reusable ones. The reusable lids allow you to peel them off for convenient opening and closing. These lids do not have a rubber gasket, so they are not leak-proof and not tamper-evident. They are FDA-approved and strong enough for bucket stacking. The standard lids have a styrene butadiene rubber gasket. A mallet is recommended for applying this lid. The standard lids are slotted to provide tamper evidence. The lid is recessed for stacking stability and has reinforced ribs to provide stacking strength. Like the standard lid, the spouted lid must be put on the bucket with a mallet to go on properly. It also has a styrene butadiene rubber gasket for secure liquid transportation. The spouted lid has all the features of the standard lid with the addition of a 38 millimeter threaded pop-out spout. When removing lids, it's best to use a bucket lid remover rather than a screwdriver or by cutting the lids off. Lid removers work quickly and effectively and will not cut or distort the container or lid. Check out the bucket lids and accessories available at usplastic.com. Thanks for watching another one of our videos. And remember, if you have a question that you would like us to answer, or maybe you have an idea for our next video, send us an email at techvids at usplastic.com or give us a call at 1-800-537-9724. We'll see you next time.